James Elder, Eiffel TV, MTK Global. With me, I've got the very talented Savannah Marshall after a brutal second round KO win today. How are you feeling? Feeling really good. Yeah. Early night. Yeah. Talk, talk me through it a little bit. Um, my opponent, my opponent get kept changed all the time, so anyway, I ended up with Esther. She, I think she'd had 7 1 1, but she'd never been stopped. And she'd been in with Stacey Copeland, Hannah yes. Ranklin from the UK. And when I'd watched her first, I thought, oh, no wonder she hasn't been stopped. Because the one I watched when she rocked Stacey, she was a nightmare, she just ran. Um, so I half expected her to do that, but the first half for the round, she had a bit of a go. But um, went back to the corner, and Peter was like, oh, you're rushing in a bit. Um, come in with light shots and in with your heavy ones, so I felt good. And I got the stoppage in the second. Took us through the <coughs> punch or combination of punches that did the damage to end the fight in the second round. I can't remember. It's a bit of a blur. I think I, I, think I caught with it was jab. I was catching her with the jabs. I think it was the jabs that was. I don't know what I caught with. Body shot. I'm not sure. The referee jumped in. Yeah. Did you Maybe think, she did caught you think me. I can't a, remember. Did you think it was the right time then for the ref to stop the fight? Was you sort um, of aware of that? What was going on? I think I did. Uh, uh, you you kind of know when you heard someone, don't you? So, but I think she. I think she thought it was. It was jumping in because saved by the bell. I thought she was saved by the bell. I don't think she realised she'd been stuck, so maybe I caught her a bit harder than what I thought. In your short pro career, you've already ticked some boxes. You've boxed in the States, you've now boxed in Bolton. How do the two compare? What's the comparison like? Nah, this was a bit better because in America, there was only my mum, dad and sister sat there. And I was on fair, so they were the only three in the arena. But here, yeah, all my family and friends got to come, so it was good. So do you feel do you feel more like a proper boxer now, having had that, that UK fight where all your friends and family and everybody are here? Because sort of some people say when they fight on the road, and not many people get to see it. It's a it's a strange experience. Uh, yeah, it's expensive, isn't it? Even here, it's two hours away from Hartlepool, so you've got to pay the bus, and then the tickets are like tickets aren't cheap, are they? <laughs> what so... is it with you and, and, and worrying <laughs> about money? Surely you're all right for No, but well. it's, a, it's, a, it's a big thing for people to come watch your box. That's yeah. why I'm, I'm really grateful that everyone comes. Yeah. And it was on telly, so people got to watch. That's the thing, Terrestrial TV, yeah. massive spike, and Channel 5 as well showing the mm. show. So I don't know, quite know where, where you fit in in the schedule and stuff, but I'm sure it'll be a lot of new fans out there and things. Yeah. What's the plan going forward then? I had a 10 week camp for two rounds, so I'm hoping to get out as soon as possible. Yeah. So it's, been, you, it's been hard work, it's been really hard work. So. Will you go straight back into the gym then? I know it's only been two rounds. You need, do you need a little break before you, you, you go back to full camp? How does it work for you? I'm still used to in the amateurs. You box five times in what, six days. So I'd be ready to go again in the morning. But um, yeah. no, it's my birthday next Saturday, so I'm going to have the week off. What will you do for your birthday, just out of interest? Well, I'm in two minds of having a like a bit of like house party or go away. I'm in two minds. House party? What are you living in 1999? That's old school. Well, it's too expensive to go out. <laughs> no, I'm John. All right. Well, I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed your UK debut. Thank you very much for coming to our full Thank TV, you. Thank you. and we'll catch you real soon. Thank you. Thanks.